What's going on guys? Taz here and welcome back to some more Minecraft Xbox 360 news and information. Today I'm going to be going over everything that has to do with TU12 that's been going on the past week. Uh, I was on a little mini vacation visiting friends and family in Ohio but I'm back but a lot of information came out of 4J Studios uh, in the past week and I wanted to cover it so I'm going to give you guys one video that you guys can watch and favorite if you guys want. Uh, I'm going to be talking about everything about mashup packs, the changelog that hopefully is going to be coming out. Uh, TU12 is finally going to be done bug fix. I'm going to be talking about it all, so if you guys do enjoy TU12 and you guys are excited for it, make sure you guys take half a second just to hit the like button. I'd really be excited to see how many likes we could reach for a TU12 uh, informational video. I'd just like to gauge it. If you guys could, just hit the like button, show your support for me, show your support for the channel. I hope you guys really do enjoy the video. Let's get right into the news. So, what you guys can see on screen here, 4G Studios has been tweeting a lot about it. So, on August 1st, they said um, that uh, there will be a trial version of the mashup packs, which is really cool. Uh, there's trial versions of uh, skin packs, so I I half expected there to be trial versions of mashup packs, but now we finally do know that there's going to be, but that raised a couple questions. And uh, just from this guy, they said, how would the trials work? Would there only be certain textures available? Would it be a timed thing? And they actually replied back, all textures will be available, and there's going to be no time limit. You just won't be able to save with the trial pack. So this means if you wanted to start up a brand new world and use a trial texture pack, you wouldn't be able to save any of your progress. So that's a little bit of a downer, but on the plus side of that, you could actually use the trial pack as long as you didn't plan on saving. So for us that play a lot of Hunger Games or Adventure Maps where you never save, well I guess in Adventure Maps you save your progress as you go, but like, uh, let's say you want to play Cake, Defend Cake Defense or a mini game or a Hunger Games map where you don't save your progress, you could use the trial version and you would never actually have to buy the full texture pack, which is kind of a plus side to this texture pack stuff. So there will be, there will be workarounds to not having to buy the whole texture pack. So you guys can uh, rest easy about that. Also, this guy, um, where did this tweet really wrong? I've read it so many times, but he basically wanted to know is if uh, your friend is using a texture pack on his own world and you join him, do you need to have, to have to buy that texture pack? And the answer is no. All you need is a trial. So you'll join his world. to will probably pop prompt you to download the trial, and you can play on his world, on his world save, with the trial version and see the whole texture pack again if you're not the one saving you're not the one that needs to have to pay to buy the full texture pack so that's really good for you guys I know a lot of you guys will take full advantage of that and hope you guys do enjoy that moving on on August 5th 4J Studios at, uh, tweeted about TU12 they finishing up on it it's finally going to be done with their little bug fixing that they're doing they hope it to be in cert testing later this week which means maybe either today which is Thursday or tomorrow Friday um, they're going to finish revealing the first mashup pack soon after that so maybe later that night on the whenever they release it maybe over the weekend but it's going to be really exciting to finally see what these mashup packs are really all about like everything coming together where they said it's going to have texture packs skin packs user interface music themed world I'm really excited to see how it all comes together and finally preview a mashup pack and of course when they give us a change log I'll make a video about that I'll go over everything that's 100% confirmed guys so if you guys are new make sure you guys subscribe because I will be going over that and then finally what I also wanted to go over was uh, this tweet by 4J Studios thanks for the 5 million sales award Microsoft but then they tweeted out a picture and as you guys can see there's the award but above that is the uh, game save uh, interface. As you can see there, there's a texture pack part. Now, we did expect this, but it's the first time we're actually going to be able to see what it's going to look like. This is the default texture pack, obviously, but they give you a little preview screen, which is very nice of them. That way you guys can actually preview what you're about to use on mostly all the blocks in Minecraft. I'll put up some... Um, pictures right now in the video of uh, this is how people preview uh, texture packs on PC there's faithful uh, there's uh, facts there's doku craft and this way you can actually preview uh, what you guys are gonna be able to use that way you guys don't gotta go find every block just to know what you're using but it's pretty cool we finally know what it's kind of the user interface is gonna look like for adding texture packs into the game obviously that's the, the default one or that's what it looks like anyway um, but it's really cool uh, I'm really excited for TU12 I'm really really excited for the mashup packs I know you guys are so if you guys enjoyed this information make sure you guys hit the like button again I will bring you the latest and greatest up-to-date information on TU12 all the confirmed stuff I hope you guys did enjoy again if you enjoyed the video hit the like button if you guys are new you guys can subscribe I will bring you the latest information in the coming days you guys can feel free to check out the other videos in the outro and I'll see you guys in the next video this is Taz deuces